Alien hat from when she went to Japan. Oh, yeah? She mostly, like, did American tourist idol bullshit there, but... Like, she went to a BTS concert and, like, in a figure skating show. Hello, by the way. <laughs> We're talking about... You got an Evangelion hat? Yeah, it's really cool. It has the number... The, the year 2020 on the front in, uh, in the colors of Unit 01. And I think it looks extremely dope. Good old purple and green. Good old purple and green. It's a good color combo. You ever get to a point where every once in a while you'll like, or there's like, there's like a word that consistently you say the wrong word? Yeah. Like for me, sometimes that shade of green mm -hmm. that is on the Evangelion, this is no joke. Yeah. Sometimes for that shade of green, I'll say, oh, that the Evangelion, it's purple and orange. And then I'll go, I mean green. Weird. Although not out loud, only when typing. Huh. I'll type orange instead of green. That's really only weird. Only for that shade of green. And it's like a bright lime green. Yeah, I know. That's weird, so huh? weird, yeah. I guess I'm just really good at typing. And uh, I have, I, I, I think... In terms of like chords when I type, you know, yeah. just like yeah, same, slam out one word real fast. Yeah, I do that too. So I end up with the word green and or uh, orange instead of green. See, I just messed it up in the opposite direction. That's so funny. Oh, yes. Mm. Well, welcome back. Uh, what are we doing today? Well, today we got to kill this guy. This guy. This guy who we married. Oh, yeah. He doesn't look very happy. What he's doing right now is not cool. Yeah. He's just lurking. That's what he's doing. Ugh, excuse me while I scooch in a little bit. There we go. Yeah, Much move better. That, that big, weird, heavy rubber chair that's that's in here. We have these yeah. heavy rubber chairs. They are super weird. They are super weird. All right. Well, I guess I can start the game. Here we go. <clears throat> I'm pretty sure she's pregnant also. I can't remember if she's pregnant or not. Um, oh, yeah, she's pregnant. I, I don't know. He's going to go... So I guess what we should do right now is decide how we're going to kill him. I was thinking maybe we could drown him in a pool. If anyone has suggestions, just throw them in chat. But uh, I was thinking we'd make a, like, a little one-by-one -one pool and then wall it in, but then put glass on the walls. I saw a little Simsy do this so that we could watch him drown to death. I remember that being like the classic way to kill a Sim, isn't it? Yeah, it super is. Why don't we do that? Isn't that like the first... Murder method devised. It's pretty much the Cain and Dable of Sims. Yeah. <laughs> walling them up. Let me. Let me. Except walling them in a pool. You're walling them in a pool. Yeah. Maybe that's wild. Walling them in a pool. I could make a little death, uh, like a little death corner of the room, like a tiny little one by one room, and have them drown in there. And what I was thinking was, yeah. Here, let me let me change it, change the day so we can see what's happening here. I was thinking was, I go in here, and I'd uh, that's where this is where pools are. Go in here, and I just do something like like that, or or maybe like. this big have him go swimming in it <laughs> how big of a pool is that is that like that's like a, the size for one person it's a personal pool a private a personal pan party private pool yeah and so a I private do, personal I do that and like for now you know let me let me knock down one wall for now so we can get in there but i basically do uh they have these huge clear windows here we go and I do one on each side. So you can watch. So you can watch. Yeah, this was Lil Simsy. This is how she killed Jeffrey Landcraft. Is it a murder if you don't watch? Well, yes, according I mean, yes. to most courts. <laughs> it's According to most courts, it is a murder if you don't watch. According to most courts, spectation is not required of even first degree murder. There you go. And I can give it a little glass roof too. 
little so tiny glass how do, roof. How do y'all, how's the chat feel about that? I can't see chat, so I don't know. The chat is loving it. The they, chat is loving it? They wish this man was dead. <laughs> They're saying drop an anvil on his head. Unfortunately, there's no anvils to drop in this game. Gosh. Can he become angry to death is the question. Actually, I would... yes, he can die of anger. Why don't I just keep this little uh, death pool area in our backyard just as a warning for our next husband? Um, and you know what? I'll give it I'll give it like an outdoor texture too. Let's see. And I'll actually uh, close it off and put a door there. Just for, for now. And since it's not permanent, I promise you this will be used to murder someone. Oh my god. There we go. Whew. That was very scary. Um, this will be used to murder someone, I promise. And then you're going to just leave it there forever as like a somewhere for his ghost to hang out. So that yeah, he, exactly. So that he doesn't sit by your bed reading a book uh, <laughs> when, when you're married to your new husband the way the previous guy has done. Yeah, it's weird that he does that. So what, what we're doing is we're marrying, We've already cheating married. on, and killing 10 guys, and we're on guy number... Yeah, we are on guy number uh, two in terms of murder. Yes. Um, we do have someone, I mean, we've created this awful woman and given her a horrible mission. That's like a thing we've done, and I don't think that we can take that back. However, we do have a nice man who just seems to genuinely love this woman. Why? Don't know. She's terrible. So, yeah, she's... Uh... She's 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 a, a psychopathic. Yeah, she's a murderer. murderer. <laughs> That's the thing. A murderess, I believe. There you go. We would say. I'm sorry, I'm so persnickety about builds. It's just when I started doing builds seriously, now I can't not take them seriously. No, that's the wrong color. That's the right color. There we go. So I don't get how this game is different from Minecraft. If you're just building stuff, it really isn't. <laughs> and, like, I think that's why people like that. So we don't want him. That was a joke, by the way, everyone. I, I do get how it's different from Minecraft. To get less angry. We want him to get more angry. Angry plus three flirty spouse. Yeah. So he's very angry right now because his spouse, he caught he caught her uh, cheating. He caught her cheating. I forget. How do you it make was, him uh, what, more It wasn't angry? really that much of a cheating, was it? It was just kind of a more like a, you were having a flirtatious conversation with somebody. Yeah. Yeah. Um, he, I a think uh, he, she kissed him on the cheek or something, and he got super mad about that. Oh, so he, uh, he has a broad definition, and he's a... Uh, <laughs> yeah, he's kind of a... Emotional cheating. Someone in the chat says. Yeah, I guess it counts. She has been flirting with this guy the whole time. Like, literally the whole time. Why doesn't he just go out and fight with someone? I bet that would make him more angry. When is your job? Oh, you have work off? Okay, that's fine. What time is it? 6 a.m.? Perfect time for a fight. <laughs> They're having an argument at 6 a.m.? Yeah, let's fight with her. She already, he already doesn't like her, so that's perfect. What, are you having a fight on purpose? Yeah, to make him more angry so he can die of anger. Whoa. Yeah, he's going to make it... They're having an unpleasant conversation. It's going to assault her face. Okay, yeah. He's being a mean guy. Whoa. Oh, my God. That's not... So he just woke up at 6 a.m. like wanting to fight somebody? An offensive <laughs> conversation. So... This is going to be a brawl. I cannot wait. Are you trying to make him yell his anger out so that he afterward requires the sort of chill down that happens in a pool? No, I'm trying to get him so angry. Was oh, it mustard gas? 
<laughs> no, it's just fighting gas. Don't you like explode into a cloud of gas every time you have a fight with someone? I'm kicking up some Doesn't dust. Doesn't that happen Wow. To you? Yeah, let's see if he wins. This looks a little weird. He lost. Okay, now they're enemies and he's very angry. So let's see if we can Are you trying to get... pin the murder on her or what? I'm trying to get him so angry he dies. I want him to be dead from being angry. So right now he's topped out. At very angry is not the top. Very angry is not the top. But uh, he can be furious. I'm pretty sure you can die from being angry in this game. You can die from extreme emotions. You can die from embarrassment. You can die from being sad. Let's see. Uh, fight. Fight her. Yeah, there we go. Fighting her again. You can die from being sad. You can die from a lot of things. Let's see. Uh, you can die from being hit by lightning, although I haven't gotten that to work. I can die from electrocution. You can die. My favorite death is when you die from eating puffer fish nigiri that was made by someone who does not have, like, a good cooking skill. And then when they die, you can see little puffer fish floating around in their ghost. Oh, my God. It's pretty cool. When did they add death formally to The Sims? It was there in the first game. Was it? Yeah, with the, um, the Grim Reaper. I thought I always I, okay. So I'm They're gonna go ahead and a, say. Oh my God, Nate's here to watch them fight. I'm not. I'm not a real Sims. Uh, I'm not a real Sims pro, you know. Yeah. However, people are now just watching them fight. I'm glad it's so entertaining. They've drawn a crowd. Is he gonna fight everybody? No. Now he's gonna try to calm down. Maybe, don't, don't oh, and I happen. accidentally got rid of that moodlet, so now I just am going to drown him. I'm sorry. What is, what is wrong with him now? He's going to go try to calm down because he's mad. I feel like Guy's an idiot. Yeah. Is he, he's just going to go stand in front of the mirror and then chill out yeah. on the computer. After getting into three public fights. I guess that's what he's going to do. He's dazed after his fights? Yeah. Come now on. he's dazed. Now I think it might be pool party time. I wanted to make him so angry he died, but I don't know. I forget what causes anger other than like her cheating on him. Um, <laughs> and I for <sighs> If anyone knows how to make him so angry he dies, that would be great. Otherwise, I'm going to stick him in this pool and just remove the door. Now, do we uh do we have any sort of a you know, verification that it is possible to die via anger in The Sims 4? Or is that just a joke someone made? I I think that it is possible because I know some emotional deaths are very possible. Bridget Omorpha says, I've made them so embarrassed they've died. Yeah, I've made them so embarrassed they've died also. It sucks. By peeing themselves in public or walking in on a woohoo. Yeah. Oh, that rules. Is he in the pool? He's in the pool now. That was easy. All I had to do if was you tell him to go in. If you build it, they will come. And yeah. uh, what's the status of these walls? Oh, they are fully surrounding the pool. <laughs> so he's dazed. I also made him skinny dip because I thought that would be more embarrassed. We, can't let, we can't let him die dazed. He needs to be prescient. Mm -hmm. Of the grimness. Oh, the, the day's moodlet will, will, it'll wear off before. I mean, who doesn't like being dazed? Oh, she's just going to drink a drink. She no, is she's, pregnant. She's throwing, she's throwing it away. Okay. She's not that much of a monster. It's lime and, it's probably like lime and seltzer. Oh, yeah. she's throwing it away. Yeah. Oh, computer. Uh, why don't you clean that up? And when your, your needs are all good. So why don't you find a new husband? Tom Tanny says anger, laughter, and embarrassment are all deaths. That's what I Sims thought. Form. I thought you could make them so angry they died. But now what I'm going to do is I'm going to find a new husband. So maybe by the time this husband dies, she can be already onto the next one. How long about is that going to take for a man to die in a tiny swimming pool? It takes a couple of days in game. Oh, what a loser. I know. He's I loser. would die so fast in there. <laughs> In real life? <laughs> I mean, same. <laughs> I would be like, all right. Give me a little chair to sit on, you know? 
so three feet of water or such. I can't remember which one of these guys are, is rich. It said you need to keep the sim in enraged status. Is that f higher than very angry? That's higher than very angry. Yeah, I needed to do more stuff that made him mad, but I forget what interact if I forget what interactions make him mad. Because fighting wasn't making him mad. It was just making him like embarrassed because he kept losing fights. Start uh, breaking his favorite plates one at a time. That's what I suggest. Yeah, I and feel like the just like as the enraged that would work. begins to cool off, break another one. Who is this buff grandpa? Oh my god, he looks like marry him, and he'll just die of natural uh, causes, old age and such. Let's see, he's a librarian. Genji Okada, librarians are so rich. All those library science degrees. Let's see. Well, he's already extremely down to flirt with us, so. Oh, yeah. We get oh, yeah, to have our first kiss right away. Jeez. Yeah, wow. He doesn't, old man doesn't have a lot of time. <laughs> Look at these dudes with these knee-high black socks on his flip-flops and yeah. his pink hat and his rolled up. Okay. We mentioned this last time. Every single guy wearing a short sleeve shirt has the sleeves rolled up at the end. That's a little bit of a exaggeration there. I mean, it is common, certainly. However, that common, come on. Yeah. Oh, God, I forgot about Cal. There's two people wearing colanders in here. I guess it is Strangerville. Oh, what is this, like, upside down day? Are you, like, in Wackyville? Uh, this is the, the Stranger Things inspired world. Well, they have Stranger... Oh. Have you seen that show? I have not seen that show. <laughs> that show sucks, dude. Oh, yes, I have seen that show. What am I talking about? I've seen that show. I've watched all of it, and it is pretty dumb. <laughs> I yeah. don't know why I keep watching it, but it is pretty dumb. It's like, have you seen E.T.? Uh, are you old now? Ha <laughs> ha. That's basically the whole yeah. thing. Remember this? Remember this? Hey, remember this? Do you remember this? Is that the doctor? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, it's like, oh, what about this? I, I mean, again, when I saw that the kid had a poster of John Carpenter's The Thing on his wall, I yeah. was just like, man, no kid had that. Nobody I, watched that movie. The Stranger Things, Stranger Things is my friend, is, is the TV show version of my friend who said, when Mad Max Fury Road came out. Yeah, I've always liked Mad Max better than Star Wars. Have you? And it's like, he definitely didn't. We've we've actually had this exact conversation before. I, <laughs> on, <laughs> on the stream. So it's like, it's like, that's what Stranger Things is. Like, no offense to it. It's very well made, you know, whatever. It it looks metic it looks gorgeous and meticulous. And I like anything that's got Eggo waffles in it and such. Yeah, that's true. Eggo waffles taste good. Yeah, but Eggo Waffles was not a very strong brand back then. I was alive back then. Alive and sentient. That's true. You are older than I, and you would know a little bit more about that stuff. Excuse me, just got to take a sip of my Diet Coke. I don't want to say I hate... I'm not saying I hate Stranger Things. I'm just saying uh, I, I think it just kind of sucks. <laughs> I watched all of it. It's fun popcorn TV, and there's nothing wrong with that. I'll tell you what I hate. What? God darn Westworld. Westworld is the bad show. I can chill true. with Stranger Things because it has this straightforward narrative focused on some naive, simple characters. However, Westworld is like one Kingdom Hearts cutscene stretched to be like 12 hours long. Yeah, that is absolutely true. It's like... We're hearing confirmation in the chat that Westworld is in fact overrated. Is it overrated or is it just bad? Did, didn't people bail on the second season? I couldn't get through the pilot or the first episode of the second season. I could not do it. I and I tried. did not watch the second season. I just felt like it was going to make me angry. Okay, this guy doesn't want to flirt with me. That's fine. The first 25 minutes of the second season's first episode, n there's every scene has more than three characters and they're talking constantly, but no one ever says anything to someone. It's always just, I think they were here. What do we do now? And it's just like, 
staring off at stuff. Hate it. Yeah. That is true. Oh, people are talking about the music in Stranger Things. Yeah, I'll admit when that beefy synth came in on the title logo, I was like, that's cool. I love a big farty synth sound, you know? I just love it. Yeah. I I think it's good. It's good to me, actually. I was like, it's cool. And then, like, after the second episode, I was like, oh, I thought they were going to do, like, a different style of 80s music every episode. Instead of, they, they went with this one that doesn't fit. Why wouldn't they get, like, a John Williams score obviously they wanted a john carpenter sound but it's like yeah. well, they wanted the aesthetic of the thing with the thing's score and the thing's title sequence but it's actually difficult to get that right so they didn't do that they're just they're they're fleshing too much stuff in for it to be evoke john carpenter at all they're they're yeah. being too meticulous it john- is simply too many things who is this excuse me who is this She's guy? thinking about diapers. Oh, my God. He's he's the mysterious stranger from Westworld. I don't know if that's a character from Westworld. I, it must be, honestly. Oh, wait. Is this me? No, it's not me. That's someone else. Is this me? No. It's someone else. Welcome back to the Goblin Bunker. <laughs> oh, there's a guy with the pink beard over there. I, I kind of love it when the game gives How characters you- with a pink beard or whatever. How do you get one of those? Like, are people just born with those? Um, let's see. Let's just keep her flirty. And she's super hungry. So let's get her. No, let's get her some one of those. I'll get her a piece of toast. So the, I really like this restaurant I made. I think it's so adorable. The waitress. So she's saying to the waitress, uh, I'll have a hamburger in the dark and a grilled cheese sandwich in my underwear, please. <laughs> Because that's all that she likes. Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> a grilled cheese sandwich in your underwear. I'd love that, honestly. Grilled no, I cheese. Wouldn't. That would be full of crumbs. Grilled cheese in the undos. Burgers in the dark. I was thinking of making a Twitter poll about how uh, I'm going to be 40 years old in a couple weeks. And there's a list of things that I've never done before in my life. And I'll do one of them to celebrate my 40th birthday. And the list will be smoke weed, drink a shot of whiskey, eat an In-N-Out burger, or go inside a J. Crew slash Banana Republic. <laughs> <laughs> I can help you with one of those things, and I want chat to guess which one. I'm a 40-year-old man who has never eaten a, a fast food hamburger or drank any alcohol or smoked a cigarette. Or smoked weed, or been inside a J. Crew, Eddie Bauer, Banana Republic, or LL Bean, or Abercrombie and Fitch. I have been inside an American Eagle Outfitters on accident. I thought that they would sell Talon Guards for my Eagle. However, it turned out to be a clothing store. Now my Eagle's dead. Oh no. Do not ever talk about Shake Shack to me. <laughs> Someone says eat at Shake Shack. <laughs> Shake Shack is just like the burger quality of in and out for $20. Yeah, Shake Shack sucks and it's completely invented by a couple of a couple of rich boys. Who just put all of this all these dirty plates at my table and just left them there? Oh, it's because there's a celebrity that's, here. That's like what happens with my desk. People my desk, in case anyone listening finds this interesting, is situated right next to I believe the most commonly used meeting room in this office, right? Yeah. So this huge glass-walled meeting room where I can see, I can make eye contact with all the people in there. And people will be waiting for one meeting to get out, and they're standing near my desk. And they will just leave their trash on my desk, literally on my desk. So I I end up throwing people's uh, LaCroix cans away. I don't know what would possess someone to not throw away their trash. Uh, they just forget. It's I, I'm not saying it's like some malicious intent. I think it's funny. Yeah. Well, one day when do we have these little phone booths for when we need to make inter- do interview phone calls and stuff. And one day I went in one and there was someone's iced coffee in it. So I went in a different one, assuming that someone that, you know, owns that iced coffee would pick it up. Okay. He's about to pee himself. Oh, he hasn't peed himself yet? Not yet. 
Lord, guy, get on my level. But he's about to. I what pee if we myself within about 14, 15 seconds any I time I get in the pool. I think we should have a party so we can all hang out while he's drowning. What do you think about that? A hang out, have a party surrounding his drowning. Yeah. So none of the Sims will ever obtain the ability to access the building element of the game. That's correct, right? That is correct. Oh, my buddy Alex Jaffe's in the chat. How you doing, Alex Jaffe? Yo, what Jaffe? up, Alex Jaffe? Sims Black Widow Challenge fan. And uh, now a uh, superstar on the DC Comics uh, uh, web content arena. Oh, hell yeah. Alex Jaffe. Alex Jaffe, I'm uh, reading hundreds of Yelp reviews of pizza slices in New York City in preparation for... What I have decided is the first episode of my show. He looks pretty unhappy. <laughs> I don't know. Oh, okay. he's stinky. Can you he imagine needs him to pee. not? He's super tired. Oh, from low energy. That's usually what happens to me as well. Yeah. You just have to pee because you're so tired? Or what? <laughs> no, well, I mean. In the pool, pretty much all, sleepy? Pretty much all of those things. Yeah. You're stinky. You need to pee and you're tired. You know, I hear like older men talking sometimes and they'll say things like oh i gotta get up to go to the bathroom in the middle of the night you know and it's like yeah what that's isn't that normal that is normal i thought right you can like I mean, it I, if you want to but like i've been doing that forever i've been having to get up and go to the bathroom in the middle of the night i don't know what's wrong going on with me anymore i love your old man impression i think it's really good well, that's my old midwestern man <laughs> yeah yeah that's a that's a specific kind of old man so it's like it's like you know phone holster old you know Dockers and a polo shirt. Yes. Long sleeved yes. polo shirt. Phone holster, essential. An essential part of this. I'm basically deriving like what the real, real life version of Ron Swanson is. So. Well, because there's nowhere for him to sleep in the pool, we can't do super fast forward. Uh, All so we're going to have to watch him bob up and down, getting slowly dirtier and dirtier. Until so, so all Sims oh must my God, be oh asleep. My God. Is he he's, dying already? He's drowning. He's drowning. Hang on, I have to. Ah, way to ruin our party, pal. <laughs> Look at him. Look at him go. Well, maybe we can have a funeral party tomorrow. Oh yeah, can we get a good zoom and a screen o? Let's see if I can do tab mode. Wait, where did his clothes come from? I thought you put him in there nude. I did. I don't know why he has clothes now. <laughs> he was buck naked. Now he's buck clothed. <laughs> Oh, there we go. Look at that guy. He's a goner. Uh, he looks like histrionically disappointed with the news of his own death. Yeah. He's like, ah, <laughs> well, I guess this is it, huh? <laughs> this is how I'm going out? He was born stupid. However, he will not die naked. <laughs> how do you want to die? Do you want to die wearing clothes or not? Tell us in the chat, everybody. I love how she's not even going to be traumatized because she's not outside. She's dancing inside. She's having a good time. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> Just <laughs> dancing unskillfully while elsewhere someone dies. I know. It's totally on brand for her. She's horrible. <laughs> Why are you even up at five in the morning? Were you up specifically to watch your husband die? She's really enjoying this. Oh, wait, he's gone. Yeah, where he go? Where he go? Beneath the waves. Hang on. Oh, I see a, I see a glimmer. Yeah, he's. Oh my God, he's. <laughs> what did he eat? Uh, cause he sunk. Yeah. <laughs> this is incredible. What if, what have you got to eat in order for your corpse to sink? Let us know in the chat. Maybe it's a lot of hamburgers. It's That's what happens to you when you go to Shake Shack. I'm pretty sure that I'm gonna die by falling off of a cruise ship or at the top of mount everest okay uh, we got a second grave for our graveyard now oh yeah okay. oh yeah i like yeah make oh yeah i thought you were gonna make it like all haphazard like a medieval graveyard like one of these <laughs> you think about one of these this is gonna be 10 graves in here so i want to have some room i saw somebody mention shake shack again in there stop talking about shake shack <laughs> we, we work don't make this into a repeat yeah. We work a few blocks away from the original Shake Shack. Let me tell you, nothing cool about that place. It's like cool 
if you are the kind of person that thinks 21 pilots is very transgressive, you know? Oh, God, yeah, she's exactly. sad again. Soon she's going to give birth, though, so I'll help. Oh, uh, Alex Jaffe says, if you see a faded sign by the side of the road that says 15 miles to the shake shack, turn around. <laughs> Very good joke. <laughs> We gotta try to befriend the Grim Reaper. Maybe we can marry him. Call the Grim Reaper Griper. Is that That's is that how you uh <laughs> I'm sorry. Call the Grim Reaper Griper. Is just the <laughs> Is this the first time I've heard something like that? I've been having a rough day, and just, that really helped. Just say, yo, how you live in Griper. <laughs> Why is it funny? <laughs> you can ask the... Oh, man. Oh, God. I love this stuff. Ask Grim Reaper to hang out. Oh, he did. He can hang out for a while. He told us. He's watching a movie with us now. She would be friends with the Grim Reaper, though. Like, I feel like she gives him a lot of his business. How you, how you live in Griper? I'm going to be saying that all day and no one's going to understand what it means except for the people that watch this stream. Graper is my new Grover Watch main, says uh, Gore Blacks. Man, what if there's a game called Grover Watch? That's that our Grover so from Sesame Street. super dope. Oh my God, I've never seen that before. I might start looking into career opportunities. I feel like I've hit a dead end here. I asked him what his career was. Oh, the Graper doesn't have a career? Yeah. Greeping ain't easy. It ain't easy being greeping. God, I just really want her to be friends with the Grim Reaper. What if this like was like a twist on Meet Joe Black where she falls in love with the Grim Reaper except she can only meet him under normal circumstances, which is when someone has just died, so she murders people just so she can talk to the Grim Reaper? Honestly, I would watch that show. Somebody, Yeah, pitch that onto the CW. they take it. They would take it. Um, why is everyone talking about Meet Joe Black? Oh, I know what the name of the, the show should be. It should be called Meeting Like This should be the name of the show. Yeah. We need to, st as in we need to stop meeting like this. Yeah, that would be super good. No, yeah. I got it. CW, get in touch with me. Um, people are talking about Meet Joe Black because the, uh, hilarious car crash moment went viral on Twitter for like the fifth time. I mean, it is so funny because he just keeps getting hit by cars. And then someone posted the picture of, of him or the like the video of him speaking in the weird accent to the lady in the hospital. Oh, yeah. The really bad patois. Yeah. Yeah. And uh, man, it got a lot of uh, a lot of weird hate on Twitter. And I'm like, oh, you people don't understand that this movie is completely bonkers. The oh whole God. movie is wild. I got an achievement for being the Grim Reaper's friend. I like that stupid movie. I got to watch it now, honestly. I've been informed that the deep state government is listening and they will pitch my Griper romance to Netflix originals. <sighs> Thanks a lot, mom. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. The Grim Reaper's our friend now. I mean. Wait, really? Yeah. We got Hello, darkness. Before. My old chum have a sim befriend the Reaper. Yep. Can the Grim Reaper be husband number 11? In that we kill the Grim Reaper at the end. I think that that is definitely the plan, right? That we're going to kill the Grim Reaper at the end. Graper things. <laughs> Here, I'm going to take another screenshot for you, just in case we ever need this one. Friend of the Reaper. And we're going to have to end it here today. I'm sorry, everyone. I'm sorry. We did befriend the Grim Reaper and also kill a uh, Sim. So we creeped on into the Reaper's life. And I think I've got a good lead on who's the who the next husband is going to be. You know what? I just want to say at the very end of the show that, you know, if I can speak really seriously for a second, that I'm glad that idiot died. <laughs> and I'm glad he died in the pool. Naked. Not naked or naked. We're not sure if the clothes were metaphorical or real. Anyway. Anyway. We love you. And I'm glad he's dead too. Oh, he she, sucked. She looks sad. There you go. She was sad. Now she's fine. She's friends with the Grim Reaper. How could you be sad when that's that's your life? The Sims' attitudes fluctuate. Like ripples. Well, the Grim Reaper's feeling your baby. Oh, I missed it. God damn it. All right. Now I gotta go. I gotta go to a meeting, actually. That was, that was wild. Uh... So stay tuned next time for the Grim Reaper 
challenge Sims the Black Widow on Kotako.com here on twitch.tv slash Kotakos. What's happening, Greeper? We're on the next episode, episode seven. We will.